Hey guys, welcome to VTech Academy. Today's topic is trigonometric ratios of 180 degrees plus theta in terms of theta. So we already know that 180 degrees plus theta lies in third quadrant that is Q3 here and make a note of the point that if theta which lies in third quadrant that is pi less than theta less than 3 pi by 2 so here we can say that the angle ranging between 180 degrees and 270 degrees falls in third quadrant and in third quadrant only tan theta and its reciprocal that is cot theta are positive and rest of the ratios are negative and now let us find the values of trigonometric ratios of 180 plus theta of 180 degrees plus theta in terms of theta. So let us begin with the trigonometric ratio sine. So sine 180 degrees plus theta. So we already know that 180 degrees plus theta lies in third quadrant and in third quadrant only tan and cot are positive. So here sine becomes negative. So here we get the result in negative and 180 is an even number so sine remains sine. So here we get minus sine theta as the result for sine 180 degrees plus theta. And then coming to the next ratio which is cos 180 degrees plus theta. So the value for cos 180 degrees plus theta will be negative. And 180 is an even number. So cos remains cos. So here we get minus cos theta. And then the next ratio which is tan. So tan 180 degrees plus theta. And 180 plus theta lies in third quadrant and in third quadrant only tan and cot are positive. So here we get the result in positive. And 180 is an even number so tan remains tan. So here we get positive tan theta as the value of tan 180 degrees plus theta. Where cot 180 degrees plus theta is positive cot theta and cosecant 180 degrees plus theta is equal to minus cosecant theta and secant 180 degrees plus theta is equal to minus secant theta. And now let us proceed and discuss few examples where we are going to use these formulas and find the result. So here the given example is find the value of sine 210 degrees. So here we can write this in the form of sine 180 degrees plus 30 degrees. And now it is in the form of sine 180 degrees plus theta which is equal to minus sine theta. So here we get the result as minus sine 30 degrees. And the value of sine 30 degrees is 1 by 2. So here we get minus 1 by 2 as the result for sine 210 degrees. And now let us proceed and discuss one more example. So here given example is cos 270 degrees. And now we have to find the value of cos 270 degrees. So we can write cos 270 degrees in the form of cos 180 degrees plus 90 degrees. And here we know the formula of cos 180 plus theta which is equal to minus cos theta. So here we get minus cos 90 degrees. And then we already know the value of cos 90 which is 0. So here we get minus 0. So that implies we get here 0 as the result for cos 270 degrees. So make a note of the point that 180 degrees plus theta lies in third quadrant and in third quadrant only tan and its reciprocal cot are positive. So hope you understood the concept. Refer more videos on trigonometry on our website vteachacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.